Twins were at the home of the Mets, City Field. Today, a matchup of NL East rivals between the Philadelphia Phillies and the New York Mets. Alongside Mark DeRozan, Dan Plezak, and guys, the Mets are looking to break out the Bruins here at home. Yeah, and to sweep this team right here would be a huge momentum boost. It is not easy to sweep a series. I don't care if it's three games or four games. I think back to Bobby Cox. His big thing was you just want to win series. Two out of three, three out of four. But when you have a chance to sweep a team, you have to take advantage of it. So bases are empty with one gun, and Adam Hazley digs in now. One out, nobody on. This one's down to third. Fielded cleanly. And there are two away now. That's in the series and four base hits. Here's the first pitch. Hard liner towards short. A leap, but he can't bring it down. Base hit. And he will add yet another game to his incredible hitting streak as it now reaches even further into the stratosphere. You know, d -Row, I don't know if this thing's ever going to end. This guy's been raking now for almost two months, and he's swinging the bat just as good now as when this streak started to start it off with his first base hit. Yeah, it, do it doesn't seem like he's cool. coming out of it anytime the soon. I wonder the pitcher that would create such a tough oh, matchup for this that. guy to shut him down because he's playing with the big part of the field. He can beat you in so many different ways. Uh, we'll leave it right there as he strikes out, and that ends the inning. Mets leave one. They trail this one one to nothing. Ronald Ture is the next to bat. The shortstop. Ronald. Phillies have an early one nothing lead here in inning number two. Hit on the ground to third. to first and there are two down. And stepping in, Gerald Hayden trying to bring in the time run from third here. Oh now. Looking to wiggle out of this, here it is. No. And that misses for ball one. Today's contest is, of course, the finale of the series, and the home side has dominated so far. They've got the opportunity to complete the sweep with a win in this one. This team going for the sweep is looking for some home cooking. It's always nice to win a series, but particularly nice when you can sweep a series at home. The offense better get it going right here because they certainly can tell from their dugout this guy is carrying himself with a presence out on the mound. He's got feel for all his pitches. And on one hand, they can be happy they've got their ace on the mound for them in this sweep game, but on the other hand, they're tasked with facing an ace themselves. It sure is. This is one of those games. Put something off there, but this is hit well anyway out to deep center. Walk off Salami! Have a bite of walk off salami sandwich. Santa Maria. So a three run blast to deep center here. Fourth home run here in the early going. And with it, they've left in front now, three to one. Yeah, he is kicking himself right now. He worked his tail off to get out of that jam and was one strike away from getting there. And then, boom, all that work goes to waste. From zero damage, 
Gerald Hayden will step toward the box here, and as he does, we flash you back to inning number three as you check out his three-run home run. A big blow early on. Here it comes. Popped him up. Torres in the shallow left. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first out. Next, it'll be now Gerald Hayden. Hayden flew Hayden. out last time up. Gerald Hayden. Here's the first pitch. Bouncer up the middle. Torres fields it cleanly. Throw not in time, and he's in there with his third hit of the afternoon. So frustrating, Hero. You make a good pitch, and you get these guys that can run around, and they're fast. You think you have an out, and all of a sudden, it turns into an infield single. Yeah, this is definitely part of his game, the ground attack, Dan. He's a speedster. He's going to get a ton of infield singles, and he knows how frustrated that pitcher is. Here's Pete Alonzo. He could really use now a knock here over three in the game so Pete. far. Alonzo. Runners on the move for second. Weak roller right side. Hold up here. Hold up here. down deep in the hole. And they'll have runners at the corners following the one out single. Now at the plate, here is Austin Meadows. He's got runners at the corners here with only one gun. Eighth inning, four to one is our score. Swing and a miss, and they'll dodge a major bullet that time. Two away. Well, I have to give credit to him on the mound for not letting that previous pitch get him. He wanted it, but he didn't get the call. But I love how he didn't let it affect him, and he comes right back with another good pitch and gets the punch out. Trying to hang a zero. Here's the pitch. Hit on the ground to third. And the inning will end as they're unable to cash in with two outs. So it's no runs on two hits, no errors, and two men left stranded. Ninth inning coming up. It's the Mets four and the Phillies one. So now here is JT Real Muto head to head against Edwin Diaz. He's hitless in three at bats. Comes set with the 0 and 1. one this one. one's down to third. Scooped up. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. You can just see that the confidence is radiating off of them out there right now. That six wins in a row, and this looks like a train that's not about to slow down anytime soon. And the score finishes 4-1 to one today. New York led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Jacob DeGrom gets the win on the mound his first of the year as he gives up 